What is going on guys and girls? My name is James Orthoxy and welcome back today to Crazy Craft. How are you doing everyone? Welcome back, welcome back. So today we've got a little bit of fun here planned because it is going to be the first time that we check out and hopefully make some cool new superheroes. So if you remember back to last episode, we basically built what we are going to be calling the Hall of Heroes. And um, <laughs> it's just kind of cool, like... I mentioned it was based off a video game I used to play back in the day called Medieval, and I was very, very thrilled to hear that some people had heard of it. Um, <laughs> I don't know, like, if you've got a PlayStation or something, and it's got, like, the, the PlayStation Store, and it's available, I would highly recommend it. It's a super, super fun game. It's kind of old school, but it's good. It's good. Um, so, yeah, anyway, what we're going to be doing today is we're going to be having a crack at this superheroes mod, and we're going to be trying to make some heroes. Now... I've never used this mod before, so you're going to have to bear with. I'm sure we will fumble through it, though, and we will get something done. But before we do that, of course, it is time for the official Fancy Lamp and or Fancy Lantern presentation ceremony. So once again, of course, you guys are amazing super super supportive and we hit our target of 10,000 likes so thank you so much once again uh yeah it's really <laughs> what the heck uh hello hello you justin what are you wait a minute you're on holiday right now what are you doing down here <laughs> is that a bowl of noodles no way are you kidding what is that noodles there's noodles in crazy craft <laughs> That's so cool. Hey, so it looks like Justin has found our secret room. Well, one of our secret rooms. Hang on, wait. <laughs> Let me go check his video out quickly. <laughs> oh, goodness. Okay, so I checked out his video. Yes, Justin has paid us a visit and he has found one of our secret rooms. But guys, he hasn't found the other two yet, has he? Oh, super secrets. Oh, this is so cool. I'm going to leave him here. <laughs> That's cool. Oh, man, I love the noodles. I'm guessing this is part of one of the cooking mods or something. But hey, I love that. Oh, my God. We can actually, like, move him and stuff as well. I don't really want to move him too much because uh, I kind of like the way he is, but... <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's really awesome. I'm gonna leave him here. That's that's amazing. Okay. Okay. Cool. Cool. Cool So yeah, once again guys, here we go. Boom Fancy lantern reward. We are looking so so fancy here And of course we have the bonus illuminati pet. So three two one activate God damn it. Every single time dudes. Why? Uh, bonus lantern once again. Thank you so much for your support. Yeah, but genuinely the, the likes and stuff on these episodes have been incredible. It's so, so motivating and I just really, really appreciate it. So once again, if we can try and hit that 10,000 likes, that would be absolutely incredible. Let's do it for Justin because he is here in spirit to save our crazy craft world. Ah, I'm kind of worried. He's on holiday. So if I break the server within the next two weeks... <laughs> I'm gonna have to sort it out and I'm terrified of that, but I'm sure he'll talk me through it. Man, what is this? It's like I don't know what that is. It's kind of like a some green onions and a big marshmallow, but a yellow one. And some juice. Give me a hug. Right, so let's go and head down here to the Hall of Heroes. So in case you guys didn't see this last episode, basically we built a brand new secret area and it is accessed from here. So boom! Dun, 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 dun! Look at that! Oh, I love this thing. This is like one of my favorite pieces of redstone. And we did loads of redstone back in the Pixelmon days. We had like, what did we have? We had the elevator and then elevator 2.0 because Justin and Dan kept breaking the elevator. <laughs> <laughs> which was super funny. Uh, we had the vault doors as well, which was also kind of nifty. But uh, yeah, I really like this. I've just got to remember to close it. That's the problem. I always forget to close it. But nothing has really changed down here. It's still the same. Oh, oh my goodness. This was suggested in the comment section on last video. And I loved the idea. Instead of having these all of these different multicolors, maybe we should have it like the blue for the heroes and the red for the villains. So I thought that was a really, really cool suggestion. And I think we're probably going to do that. I like this. Unless you guys prefer, like, the multicolored look. But I do think that the blue for the heroes and the red for the villains is kind of cool. And maybe we could incorporate it into here when we actually have our hero maker as well. So, uh, our villain maker, even. But yeah, as you can see, we've got loads of space. So we better get cracking. Well, this is the hero maker. And so far, I don't really know what we're doing, but I thought let's start off with something easy and maybe let's go for the Deadpool one. Ah, the crafting recipes are not in here. So do I have to find them online? I don't really know what I'm doing, truth be told. <laughs> um, um, I, I know where the crafting recipes are. Hang on, bear with. 
Hey, I actually fixed it. Woohoo! <laughs> so what I had to do is I had to go in the config files and enable it so we can actually see the crafting recipes, which is good. And I think from what I've seen here, uh, dun, 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 dun. it's pretty cheap to make, actually. We just need some black iron boots. Ooh, that's fancy. Um, and we need some cloth, some nether brick. Now, the one thing that's going to be a little bit tricky is the mutant gene. Now, from what I've read up on, we need to basically build a microscope and then look, I think, at a wither skull through a microscope or something. It's kind of cool. Um, but what we're going to do first here is we're going to just make a few of the pieces that we can do. And, um, do I have any cloth? I really don't think I have any cloth. Oh no, this is so sad. I've got like so much stuff that uses cloth. Like all of these things are cloth, but I don't actually have any left over. So I'm going to need some string as well. But the good thing is because we have our equivalent exchange, it's not that difficult to create lots of them. Do I not have any string whatsoever? What? Really? That is that is quite surprising. I've got so much rubbish in here, but no string, which is quite amazing. I've got a spider pet. <laughs> Give me string. Hang on. Gives you string. Give me string. String me. Please. <laughs> Jumpy's wall climb hangs on wall. Was... Does it hang on the wall? Oh, it does. <laughs> <laughs> That's really, really cool. Okay, well, I'm going to wait for this little buddy to give me some string here. Unless, of course... Oh, I've got string in my inventory. Right, okay, panic averted. Um, let's go and get ourselves these equivalent exchanged. So I'm going to need cloth. I'm going to need obsidian, which I think I have somewhere. I'm going to need some nether brick, which I don't know if I have, but it's not going to be difficult to get. So um, let's go in here. Do we have anything that we can use? No. We've got cyan wool. Well, that's no good. Okay, so let me um, let me put some of these recipes in. And all we're going to need here is five string. So if I get four string and then, um, why did I dupe wool when I've got loads of wool? I don't know. <laughs> We've already got loads of wool. Have we got a crafting table down here? No, we don't. Fantastic. Um, I could probably do with a crafting table down here. Huh? It would make life a little bit easier. Have we got any wood duplicated? No. Oh, we're so unprepared for this. Um, so yeah, plans for like crazy craft. Whilst I just do a few things here in the background, uh, I've got a few ideas for a few little practical jokes and pranks that we can do, which I know you guys love the pranking and stuff. Um, so I've got a few ideas. As of right now, though, I don't really know when we're going to do them, but I'm thinking probably pretty soon. I've got some funny stuff that I want to try out. Let's um, Let's put a crafting table there. Because why the heck not, right? And let's go string, 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 string. Whoa, 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 whoa. Yeah, there we go. So that is normal cloth. Now, if we equivalent exchange this... What the heck? Sp <laughs> Spider-Man is making us go up the wall. Very, very interesting. So if we use this, then we've basically got an infinite supply of cloth. And then what we can do is we can dye it as and when we want to. Assuming, of course, it has a value, which it does. Hey, very, very good. So we're going to need some... Um, Let's take a little look here. We're going to need some red cloth, so we're going to have to get some red wool, which is not going to be too bad. Uh, let's go and get some flowers. i got to say, I'm loving this equivalent exchange. It's so, so useful for, like, those annoying little items. Oh, I've already done quartz. No, I don't think so. Uh, but, yeah, it's amazing for all these super, super annoying little items that it sometimes takes a little while to get. So I think I've got everything I need here. I've got the iron. I've got this, that, and the other. All I need to make now is the... Um, the microscope, but we'll do that in just a second. Wait, what did I need this for? Oh, yeah, we'll just make a few of these bricks. How many did we need? I'm just going to make six. Why the heck not? There we go. There we go. There we go. There we go. Fantastic. Okay, so let's go down to the Hall of Heroes there and let's make all of the other pieces apart from the chest plate, which we're going to need to work on in a little bit. So let's go down here. Da -da -da. Are we ready? Oh, the spider, this spider pet is so annoying. <laughs> <laughs> it just makes you climb all the walls. Oh my goodness. All right. Okay. Okay. So let's go and head here. This is the first time we are using our hero maker. So we need to go red cloth, that kind of pattern. So red cloth across the top and then normal cloth on the bottom. Boom. There's the Deadpool mask. Oh yeah. So let's start here right at the beginning. Let's go. Eh, we'll go this side for now. Yeah. Look at that. We're going to be putting these on and trying them out in just a second, but I kind of want to see what the set looks like. So the pantaloons, I made a really no weird noise in my mouth there when like <laughs> pantaloons, my bad. Um, what was it, red cloth or white cloth? I can't even remember. Yes, this one, red cloth, fantastic. And then how do we do the boots? Very simple, black iron and red cloth. So red cloth. Can you only make these in the um, in the maker or can you just do these in a crafting table? Because this is essentially a crafting table. I thought it would like put the pieces in the sides, unless it does do that, hang on. 
Boop, boop. No, it doesn't. Ah, oh, that's a shame. That's kind of weird. I thought it maybe maybe did something, but no, it kind of feels just like a normal crafting table. But there we go. We have the boots, the pants, and the hat. But what we're going to need to do now is make ourselves a microscope. Now, I'm worried this is going to be super, super expensive. Oh, there's so many bits. Microscope tube, stage, block vine, illuminator, microscope base. Oh, God. Oh, we need more black iron blocks as well. Oh, they're so expensive. That's the problem. Oh, man, this is all just black iron, isn't it? Hmm. Okay, well, I'm going to have to go and make this now. This may take a little bit of time, but I won't bore you with it. Oh, electronics as well. Oh, oh this is going to be so annoying. All right, okay, okay. So I'm going to go and check my duplicator tree, grab myself my black iron blocks, and then I'm going to go and make this thingamajig here because, yeah, it may take some time. And it's raining. God damn you, rain. Okie dokie, so the microscope is made and it was so expensive. Oh my goodness. Apparently I was reading up on it and um, you only need mutant genes for four different uh, suits out of the whole lot. You only need four, but... <laughs> <laughs> Hello, Opal. How you doing? You all right? Hope you're good. But yeah, you need to make it. It's just something you have to do. So the only thing is we need a wither skull. And to be honest, I only have like two of them and they're on my witchery altar. So what we're going to do here is we are going to borrow this skull. And does it have an equivalent exchange value? No, it doesn't. Oh, that's annoying. I really thought it would have a value so we could like make another one. But for now, anyway, we're just going to use this one. I think that's what we do. And then maybe we'll have to go on a big wither skull hunt to replace that because I've only ever had like two. And withers, like wither skeletons are quite hard to find unless we have like a... No, we won't have a spawn egg, will we? Because it only does the modded mobs. Yeah, maybe we'll have to find some more. It doesn't matter. But all right, let's go and stick this in. And yeah, there it is. Woohoo, the mutant gene. Wow, that worked really quickly. <laughs> I wasn't quite expecting that. So anyway, let's go out of the microscope here and let's go back to Deadpool. And here we go. We need nether brick, red cloth, and mutant gene. Now I noticed something about this last time we did this. And oh no, what did I do with my nether? Oh, hang on, wait, wait. I think I, <laughs> I think I stored them. Hang on. Oh, can't find them, but the good news is we have equivalent exchange, which will always save the day, which is very, very good. Hello, Al. How are you? Are you good? Yes. <laughs> oh man, I've just got these owls going around. To be honest, I kind of want to breed more. I just want to fill my house with guard owls because I think they keep an eye on things whilst we're gone, you know what I mean? I think we need some more owls. We're definitely going to do that. So anyway, I've got some more of these bricks finally uh, and the recipe is like that. So that's pretty straightforward. Let's go and make this. So dun 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 dun. Now the one thing I noticed last time we did this and I was kind of curious. I did the recipe, and then I still had two black iron blocks. So I wonder if it's actually taking the items away from me. Which I thought was really weird. Boop. And we... S no, it took the mutant gene. I'm so confused. I s I I'm not even going to question it. <laughs> Fine, cool. Look at that. Woohoo! We have the Deadpool suit. And I think... Look at that. Whoa! Doesn't that look amazing? <laughs> <laughs> I really, really like that. I think that looks awesome. Okay, so should we give this on a bash? Let's stick some stuff that we don't really need for now in our inventory. Let's get rid of all this gubbins for now. Uh, let's put our chicken. We've got loads of chicken here. All right, okay, okay. So let's go poop and let's go poop and let's go poop and let's go poop yeah look at that woohoo so that's our um queen scale which we'll just leave there for now but look at this this is deadpool hey pretty fancy right so what have we got here we've got strength three we've got speed four teleportation acrobatics and regeneration i have no idea how this thing works just yet but can we double tap we run really really quickly can we fly no but we look oh <laughs> Oh god, we still got Ronald on our head and we've got this weird, we've got like our green hat still on or like our hood. But the swords look amazing. Look at the swords, guys. Hang on, where is it? Where is it? Where is it? Oh, we got a backpack on. Um, hang on, hang on, hang on. Bear with, bear with. Yeah, look at that. That is so nifty. I love these. So apparently there's a sword that we can make a well, D uh, Deadpool's katana. But unfortunately, that isn't showing up a crafting recipe. Then again, it is only one attack damage. So how do we work these? Oh, let's do an Illuminati. Don't tell Justin. It's our secret. Okay, so I was like messing around with this. And I was thinking, why won't you work, suit? Oh, hello, Chuck. 
<laughs> How you doing, here, buddy? You've got a diamond today. Where's your big sword gone? Have you, you can't be trusted with it. It's been taken away. I saw what you did to all those boyfriends, Chuck. Those were my boyfriends. Well, they were actually just... They were a present from me to Justin. The gift of boyfriends. Don't think we're done with the boyfriends, Chuck. They will return with vengeance. You cannot doubt that for a second. And there's toothless hay. <laughs> so yeah, all the keybinds are so messed up because there's like so many things that you can click on. But I think I figured them out. So this hopefully should be ability one. Whoa. Hey, look at that. Oh, no, hang on, hang on. So this is the Deadpool ability. Now, number one here is the ability, like the ability of teleportation. So it makes you like skip ahead a little bit. So that's kind of nifty, isn't it? That's actually really useful. Uh, what have we got? Ability two. We have, uh, oh, no, if we do three first, which I believe is H. Boop. Oh, no, that's hat. <laughs> um, oh, no, it's worked as well. It's worked as well. It's given us the gun. So if we click on the letter G, which should be two, and we right click. There we go. We've got a gun. Oh, can we be trusted? That is the question. Look at this. It's a tiny, tiny little pistol, though. But I think it's pretty cool. Have we got anything to shoot? Uh, where are you, sheep? Oh, God, I'm the worst Deadpool ever. The gun doesn't shoot. Why? <laughs> Do I need bullets or something? That's probably what I need, but... It's not really doing any... Hang on, wait a second, wait a second. I think this is a recipe for bullets, so if we do it like that, maybe? Are these the right bullets, though? That's the question. Go! Sh shoot! Worst Deadpool ever! <laughs> oh, this is a disaster, lads. Um, I don't know how to shoot the gun. I know that I can double jump, though. Can I do that? Jump, 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 jump. Why does that not work? Jump, double jump, press spacebar once, then again. Must be... Uh, must time this right. Oh, do I need to time it right? Is that? That's not a double jump. What the heck? This is. Oh. <laughs> I'm such a bad Deadpool. The thing is, though, I really like this ability. That's really cool, the teleport. And I do look really nice. So, hmm, I think maybe, like, I'll try and find out how to make the katana. I don't exactly know how to do it just yet. But anyway, this is the Deadpool one. And this is the first character. So I think what I might do, actually, is I might go and bash out another one of these suits in today's episode. Just to kind of get us rolling here. So what we'll do is we'll stick on our queen scale back whilst we do this. Apparently, Deadpool as well has, like, super high health. And he doesn't take very much damage, so that's kind of sweet. Haven't quite worked out how to do the gun yet, but I'll work on it. Who should we pick next? So I thought we'd have a crack at this one here, which is called Glacius, which just looks so, so cool. It's actually really cheap to make, but the only thing that we didn't have was packed ice. And I was like, for a second, oh no, we've never found ice spires. And then I remembered these amazing icy NPC villages actually have packed ice generating inside them. And here it is. Look at this stuff. <laughs> so I've got myself my cheeky, sneaky silk touch pick here, and we can just grab a couple of packed ice. Oh, no exchange value. Really? Okay, that's interesting. So we should try and grab like a little bit of this because we're going to need it for the Glacier suit. I was kind of thinking like this should really have uh, an exchange value seeing as we actually need normal ice as well. So let's just grab this. Uh, but yeah, look at this place. It's so, so pretty. I love like the um, these type of generations for villages. Look at it. It's so, like, amazing and icy and magical. It's so pretty. I've never seen one of these before. This is like a watchtower or something. It looks awesome. Is there anything at the top? I doubt it, but we can take a look. How do we get inside? <laughs> hey, how do we get it? What? Ah, there's the entrance. Okay, okay, okay. So, oh, there's people up here. Oh, snap. Hello. How are you doing, guys? Whoa. God, there's a party in here. What have we got? We've got some leather caps. Oh, that's not very exciting. But yeah, check this out. Really, really awesome, isn't it? Nice. I love this place. Okay, so I'm just going to go and steal everything these villagers have. And then we'll make a new suit. Boom, 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 boom. Whoa. Look how cool that looks. Oh, I think this is my favorite one out of the two. It looks amazing. So what have we got here in terms of abilities? Oops, screenshot save. Fantastic. We've got strength, speed, and acrobatics. Wow, that is really fast. Okay, whoa. And we float as well. Ah, look at that. It's like a proper double jump. Isn't that nifty? All right, okay. So let me see. Uh, suit ability one is... Um, da, 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 gives the opponent slowness. So let's try and find a willing volunteer. Oh, I just, I just pressed something and it, it froze a load of stuff. Hang on, let me do it again. Let me do it again. How did I do that? Whoa, look at that. <laughs> 
Isn't that cool? I can just make everything super, super icy. Oh man, that's awesome. Okay, so apparently there's one called Blizzard. So if I hold this down and I hold it down for 15 seconds, which is quite a long time actually, apparently it's supposed to summon some kind of Blizzard. I don't really know if it's going to do it though. Um... Yeah, I don't know. Also, apparently you can summon someone called Frozo. I don't really know how to do that right now. It's like all the keybinds are so, so messed up. I'm holding down J, which is apparently my ability 4, but it's not doing anything. Do something. Please, Blizzard! Um, huh. <laughs> I don't really know if it's going to do it or not. I need to sort out all these keybinds because they're such a mess. Oh! Oh, what's that? What's that? What's that? I think that's the freeze ability. Hang on, let's try this out. <laughs> Was that just firing snowballs? I think we're just firing snowballs. Apparently, we don't take any fall damage either, but I really love this move. That's awesome. Look at that. I'm probably going to have to clear this up. <laughs> Let me see if I can... Oh! Oh, can I do Frostwalker with this? Hey, look at that. I can freeze, like, all the water as well. Hey, that's cool. All right, let me see if I can get this, this thing to work, this blizzard. No, it doesn't appear to be working right now, which is a little bit of a shame. But apparently we can um, do Blizzard. We can summon Frozo. <laughs> Whoever the heck Frozo is, I'm not too sure. Oh, no, that's the wrong button. Um, so what I think I'll do for next episode is I'll try and get all of this. See, I'll show you, actually. I might as well. Um, but if we go down to, uh, where is it, where is it? Superheroes, then we actually have a few clashes here for the suit abilities, which is a bit of a shame, to be honest with you. Um, because there's a lot, and as you can see, all of the red ones are ones that are already taken, so it's difficult to find the right keys, but I'll do my best. But yeah, this is amazing. So ladies and gentlemen, today, wow, look at the sword. That's <laughs> so cool. So today, we have managed to create ourselves two of these amazing superheroes, and I really, really hope you guys enjoyed that. So if you would like to see me make some certain heroes next, then let me know in the comment section below. We'll try and probably make them all, because there are so, so many of them. But we had to start somewhere. I will try and sort out the keybinds, so we can show like all of these amazing moves off properly. But uh, yeah, until then, I think that's going to be about it for this episode here on Crazy Craft. So yeah, I really hope you guys enjoyed it. You've been asking for this superheroes mod for so, so long. So I'm really excited to get into it. Um, but yeah, before we go, if we can please try and hit that 10,000 like goal, that would be amazing. If you could just poke me in there before you leave, that would be greatly, greatly appreciated. And also, if you're not yet subscribed, go for it because we do Minecraft on fun. But until next time, thank you once again for watching. It's been such a pleasure. As always, thanks. Run to you.